Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we'll be covering IMO for class 3, chapter 1, number sense, in the section, everyday mathematics and achiever section. Question number 21. Madhu wrote a number on the blackboard as shown below. She has written 6 in the hundreds place and 9 in the units place and the tens place is blank. If it is formed from three different digits, then which of the following digits could be placed in the gap to make it the greatest number out of the given options? Now option 0. If this number is filled in the gap, we will get the option as 6, 0, 9, B, we'll get it as 6, 5, 9, 6, we get it as 6, 9, 9, and D, we get it as 6, A, 9. Now, option C is greatest, but the condition here is it should be formed using three different digits. And here, digit 9 is repeating, so this is not the correct answer. So, next greatest will be 689. So, option D is the correct answer. Question number 22. Sohan has two baskets full of some token numbers. He likes the numbers that are in the red basket. Which of the following numbers formed by using the digits given in the basket will he like the most? Now, Sohan likes the numbers which are in red. So, we need to pick the option which uses 9, 6, 5 and 2. Option A is 8, 7, 6, 3. 8 is in, not there in this red basket. Now, 6, 5, 2, 9. 6, 5, 2, 9. So, all of these numbers are in the red basket. So option B is the correct answer. Question number 23. Sonia is playing with some number cards. She made a deck of these cards and pulled the cards as shown below. 5, 6, 8, 2. Her mother asked which is the largest possible four digit number that can be formed by using all cards. Help her to find the answer. So, you have to find the largest possible four digit number. So, whenever a largest number is asked, you need to pick the uh, greatest number and form the number 8. So, next comes 6, 5, and 2. So, 8, 6, 5, 2. Option A is the answer. Question number 24. Mrs. Sharma wrote a four-digit number on the blackboard. Three students, Anshu, Vishal and Badal, said the following statements about that number. Anshu said, it is a four-digit number but not the least. Vishal said, it is less than the largest four-digit number but greater than 9,997. Badal said, its hundreds place digit is 9. Okay. If all of the three students said the truth, then find the number. Now, if you take what Vishal said, it is less than the largest four digit number. Which is the largest four digit number? 9, 9, 999 nine. but this number should be greater than 9997 nine, so that is 9998 nine, nine, is greater than 9997 nine, nine, okay and its hundreds place is 9 and it's a four digit number but it's not the least so option p is the correct answer question number 25. Four boys are playing a number game. Each of them are writing their favorite number. 
arrange them in the ascending order that is smallest to the biggest number okay now these are the numbers these are their favorite numbers so let's arrange them in the ascending order and if you check the thousands place this is the least one so raj raj has written the smallest number next will be 5600 and 5400 so tarun comes next then rahul 7000 is the greatest number so ravi comes at the last now let's see which is this option raj tarun rahul ravi option d is the correct answer next is the achiever section question number 26 the given table shows the number of eggs produced on a farm in the first 5 months of the year so these are the months and here number of eggs produced in jan 5961 feb march april and may now which of the following statements is correct okay first option the number of eggs produced in april were less than in february so how many eggs were produced in april 4907 and how many are produced in february 4228 okay it is not less Uh, the eggs produced in april are more than the eggs produced in the february so this is not the correct answer next the number of eggs produced in may were less than in march how many eggs were produced in may 5164 and how many eggs were produced in march 5879 okay so the number of eggs produced in may is less than the eggs produced in march so this is correct statement so option b is the correct answer question number 27 state t for true and f for false p 3900 is same as 3900 so p is true It's three thousand nine hundred. Now Q is eight thousand forty tens ten ones. So it is eight thousand forty tens is nothing but four hundred plus ten ones. That is eight four one zero. So this is also true. Nine thousand plus three hundred plus twenty plus six. Nine thousand three hundred and twenty six. This is also true so let's check the option where p q r are true so option b p is true q is true r is true so option b is the correct answer question number 28 match the following column a and column b so 400 plus 60 plus 8 it is 468 so what is p P is three. Third, and what is Q? Four thousand plus six hundred plus eighty. Four thousand six hundred and eighty. Option one. So that is Q is option one. Next, R four hundred plus six. That is four hundred and six. R is four. And S will be two because that's the last option left. Now let's see which matches the answer. P three Q one R four S two. So option C is the correct answer. Question number twenty nine. Identify the number using the given clues. I am an odd number. Now check the options. So which are the odd number? 
this is not an odd number so this cannot be the answer my tens digit is the greatest one digit number which is the greatest one digit number nine so let's check which has the tens digit as nine 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 so this cannot be the answer because it has eight in its tens digit now answer could be a or b my hundreds digit is an even number which is a hundreds digit this one so both are even number so the answer still could be a or b my thousand digit is the least odd number which is the least odd number one one is the least odd number so option b is the correct answer question number 30 sonali spilled ink drops on her homework sheet as shown below now p is the statement q and r which digit must be written to make the above sentence correct okay now to make this statement correct 432 should be greater than if we have to put in the p here and check if the number we get is less than this so if we put 2 then this number will be greater 6 then this number will be greater so this is not the option it won't become the smaller next if we put 3 so it will be 436 so this will be still greater now 446 432 is not greater than 446 so option a is the correct answer if we cross verify 843 is less than 848 because we're going to put the q value here that's true and then 792 is equal to 792 so that's the value of r option a is the correct answer